What's up guys, Deck Opinion here, and we're playing some Tug by Nerd Kingdom, and I'm going to go over a few basic starting tips to help you guys survive in the new survival mode. I like the survival mode, it's pretty cool, I mean it needs a lot of work, but I like the foundations of it so far, and I like where it's going. So, we're going to need to find four things, basically three things though, we need to find food, which will also have vines connected to it, we need to find food and vines, actually, here's some right now, so here's uh, the vine. And here's the food. So we have a pumpkin and we have a vine. So the vines used to tie items. So we're going to need some wood is the next item. So we have wood right here. So the big ones are for like weapons, which we'll go over later. We're looking for tools right now, so we're going to grab the small one. And just keep collecting this stuff. And the next thing, the last thing we need is going to be stone. So you can find like little stones like this. And that's pretty much what we're going to be looking for. These big ones we can't get until we craft a hammer which we will craft a hammer. Actually, we just got enough to do that. So I'm gonna show you the first thing. This little thing that looks like a potato is the one that crafts hammers. Let's let me wait until I actually do that because I wanna show you all three of the stone pieces before I craft them because they look kinda of similar but they're not. That's another stone. Pretty dried up in here. It's okay, we'll keep collecting stuff but I want to show you guys a couple more things. We'll go over crafting. I'll show you guys everything. Just keep collecting stone, keep collecting food, and keep collecting trees. So if you look in the middle of the screen, you'll see um, on the bottom, you'll see a red bar, a yellow bar, and a blue bar. So you guys might can guess it, but the red one's your health, the yellow one's your stamina up, and the blue one is your, your hunger. So, I mean, that goes to show, really, that hunger is super important because that blue one's almost halfway and we only been playing for like two minutes so I actually feel that your hunger goes down very quick for the amount of food that's around here because there's not a lot of food around here but nonetheless I say that and then we find we find some food so I have, I have a couple items I can show you so here's how the crafting system works these are two of the major items the pointed one and the potato looking one so potato one is gonna make the hammer and the pointed one is going to make the pickaxe and there's gonna be one more that kinda it's like it looks like a shovel and that's gonna be the axe so what you need to do is you need to take a stick and drop it by hitting E you just pick it up and hold E then take a vine put that together and then take which one you wanna make we're gonna make the pickaxe first and then hold G we don't have to hold it, just hit G. I'm used to holding buttons. And so there we have it. We've crafted a pickaxe. With this, we're able to dig, but it's a little, it lets me down a little bit because we aren't able to collect what we dig. Therefore, we can't really like build a hut or anything like that and survive throughout the night. But this is an alpha. I'm sure they will add that soon and we'll be able to craft houses and all that great stuff. But that right there's the pickaxe. So to be able to collect stuff again, you need to let go of the pickaxe. So you want to hit E and then just click it and then click it back in here. So to eat food, you right click it and then you left click it. If you have more than one, it'll add all of them to your hand. So now let's create a, a shovel. So let's drop this, then a stick, and the, then the vines, and hit G. If your powers combined, booyah. This is a shovel. Now this shovel is for knocking down the bigger as you see the bigger areas now that's good like hitting knocking out the bigger rocks some brain fart there so you can get them quicker that's always good again you can't pick up an item unless you remove the tool which I find to be very annoying I wish you can pick up an item so we need to find one more food and we have our last bit to make an axe so let's see if we can find uh, one more vine and then add our last tool but I think I uh, went over everything in the basics you know I showed you guys the food and how to eat, you know, your running meter, your life meter. I showed you guys how to craft and what to look for. And here we are. We have food, our vines. Let's put it down. We have our vine. We have our stick. And we have our last one we haven't crafted yet. Which, with your powers combined, I am an axe. So this is the last tool I want to show you guys. You guys can just literally cut down any tree. And it just cuts it down. It collapses. It's pretty awesome. So... Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And I hope it helped out. 
And uh, yeah, we'll be doing more Tug videos coming soon. I like this game a lot, and I can't wait to see some further updates. And uh, it's going to be amazing. So, Dusk and Fly, like and subscribe. More Tug coming soon. Peace.